it's born to be transported and it's cheap and easy and efficient to move around the world. So what we've built is a studio environment which looks, feels and works like the kind of studio you'd be accustomed to spending time. It's air conditioned, it's nicely lit, it's designed to feel like a studio. Well, the reaction when people first opened the door has been overwhelmingly positive. It's disarming. You'll swing open these big steel doors and straight away you're confronted with natural woods and clean lines. It's been on set recording ADR for a feature film. So that's why you'll see it set up like it is. But it could easily be in an editorial or a mixing capacity where you'd more likely have an edit position here, maybe a client area there. But increasingly, people are wanting to shoot at locations that are excellent for putting together green screens or large scale sets but often those places don't have anything in the way of resource for editorial or creative. What we're doing is saying, well, this is always here. If the actor is there, this is there, and we're ready to shoot ADR, you're taking a whole layer of complexity out of scheduling ADR for actors. And there's a creativity benefit as well, because it seems that the actors much prefer doing ADR when they're in character, quite often in costume. And it's at their convenience and it's on stuff that's very fresh. They've just shot or shot yesterday. I've heard of ADR being shot in hotel rooms. We've heard of ADR being shot in porter cabins. So yeah, you could always put something nearby or on set. The difference of course with this is it's purpose built for recording audio. So yeah, we're in an industrial estate right now and yet we can't hear anything of the outside because it's soundproof. You can flip between the different configurations just by de-rigging and re-rigging. So you wouldn't need, for example, a script stand or a stall for a, um, an editorial type setup. You just take these away and put in your, your edit desk and any kit that you needed for that. We've got the one and it's proving really popular and it's finding a niche for itself in on-set ADR. But there's a number of scenarios in education, in music, in TV, in kind of broadcast where we think this has a place.